hi everyone! Welcome back, and I'm gonna be in this video. I'm gonna be doing my first anime figure review. Yay! And we're gonna be doing Mr. Space Dandy from Space Dandy. <laughs> um, I got into this show a while back. I think once it came out, I was intrigued by it because I'm like, oh, okay, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. And well, I kind of fell in love with it. And when my roommate came back. From her late night class, I kind of rewatched the two first episodes because I'm like, you have to see this trip that I just went through. And we basically binge watched the majority of the season, and it was probably the best night ever. And we did end up binge watching the second season through um, Skype, I think, and it was great. So let's start the review with his box. I got him on Amazon. Uh, I kind of took a hold of the price because it's like I figured as time goes on he's gonna go up and I haven't recently checked him but I do believe his price went up but definitely try Amazon I'm sure you will find a price that appeals to you or if you know any other site definitely try that but I got him with the price that works for me and you can uh it's him and honey i just got him because look at him i i, I needed him but here's this box the front is the usual kind of the opening with the cool funky colors and everything that's all around the box and that's really cool so you have the figure right here on the company with his name in English and in Japanese. Put a little of that there. Space dandy. On the top you have a cool star and you have all of the characters. It really it really sticks with uh, like the opening, how colorful and just trippy how everything is. There's Honey and then there's him. You could have, I could have gotten them both together, but I really like Dandy because it just, with her together with this package, would have just been a little too much for me, price-wise, but I really, I just, I, I needed him for obvious reasons. So here's him. Figured the different expressions that he does come with, different angles, and stuff in Japanese that I, I, I don't know, but it's probably just the normal where you got him and everything. I really like this box. It's really colorful and it's just, I, I love it. Alright, let's take a look what he comes with. He comes with two expressions. This one. With two weapons. And two arm poses. Obviously, one is to hold the phaser and one to hold this. So that's what it comes with. This is how it's all set up. Obviously he's out of the box, but you can see this is where he, where he sits. So here's the figure. He is well painted and his sculpt is really good, really detailed. And as you can tell here, he has little, he carved in hair. I like how it would flow everything really gives you know like the wrinkles of his clothing and it just it really it really looks like him he comes with a stand here's a better look of it as you can see the little little plastic stands that you can put them on he stands pretty good on his own as you can tell here he doesn't he doesn't easily topple over he's not top heavy or anything but I think he looks really cool with the stand so that's why I keep them with the stand obvious cool little features these aren't necessarily um, flat as you can slightly tell here they pop out they're three-dimensional yeah three-dimensional but they pop off his little tress crest here is kind of you can kind of feel it this moves it's not like it's molded onto him which, which is pretty cool. 
bell too. Oops. Oops, oops. Yeah, his bell. You can feel his bell. And this moves. As you can tell from the phaser, it's kind of see-through. See-through play. It's, it's a plastic. It's cool. It's not like one thing and they just painted it blue. I thought that was a cool touch. You can see his fingernails. And I love his expressions, really. I, I really do. Just to take off his head, you just kind of loosen a little bit. And it just pops right off. This does slide out. Let's just keep that there. I like how it's like... Oh, there it goes! My biggest fear with these kind of... <laughs> figures is these kind of like always like popping off flying off and I'm never gonna find him again because I have a problem because it's like it's him another figure and another figure have something similar like that and I know one of them I had a heart attack and I thought I lost one but luckily I didn't I found it and it's like it's smaller than this so it's oh. so yeah just just be careful of flying off but yep you can just take this out it's so hard with one Yep, this comes right out, and with his arm, it just pops right off. And where you can just pop in his other arm as you see fits. Obviously, you can mix, mix and match. You know the different uh, weapons, different facial features uh, between the two faces, but it's really cool. And for this, it's this pops off. Here we go. And you put it on this way. Not, not the silver into his hand, but this way. That's the easiest way I found it. Yeah. So this comes off. And that's pretty much it. And that just that wraps it up for this episode or video with Mr. Dandy. You can get them, as I said, on Amazon. I'm not sure really about the price anymore, as I know he did go up, but I definitely enjoy him in my collection. He's pretty tall, so he's he kind of towers over the rest of my figures, but he is awesome. Well, I'll see you guys again in my next video. I will hope you have a great day. Bye!